$1.40 to $17 are some recent sales prices for these changeover coins. 50 cent coin from 2016. Love finding those ones. Um, let's see what we can find in this 50 cent coin roll right here. But on the end of it, we do have a 1997. That is a lower mintage year. So um, only 4.3 million minted, which considered is considered rare. Under 5 million is considered rare. $1.50 to $24.50 for this particular coin are some recent selling prices. So let's um, open up this roll here and we'll search through the whole lot of the 50 cent coins. And um, yeah, we'll start with that 1997. Not in awesome condition, but I'll put it aside. Yeah. Okay. 71. 73, that's a lower mintage year as well. Um, Four million of these minted. So $1.75 to $70 is a recent selling price on these 973s. This one's not in great condition. So the lower end of that price range for that condition. I probably should have checked that one for the double bar, but I've got a, got a fair few of them. The 1979s and the 1980 coins can have a double bar feature. Uh, let's see if I can find another coin that I can search in this roll for that double bar to show you. Ooh, 78, that was close. A lot of these coins were minted, so I sort of tend to let them go at this stage. 1980s, so these 1980s can have the double bar. So where you search is behind the emu's head up here. Um, and you can get two little lines of metal coming in towards the emu's head, and this one doesn't have it. So, but so I'll give you some prices just so you get a bit of an idea. So some prices on the double bars, the 1979 version, $1.45 to $15, and the 1980 versions, $1.50 to $25 each, so recent prices. Actually, that one doesn't have it, so I'll put it into the bag. Oh, actually, some of those can have a, yeah, this one does have it, actually, that little blob of metal down the bottom of the robe of the um, gentleman here. Yes, did sell one of those the other day, too, so there we go. Put that aside. Last coin, 1996. There we go, cool. 